Welcome to Crash Racer. Today we are playing Grid Legends and I'm really looking forward to this. We are back on the story mode. We're making good progress so far. Let's see if we can continue that. I'm playing on the hard difficulty level and our next challenge in the story is induction. So it's the opening race of the semi-pro season. We are going to be racing in Moscow. Let's see how we get on with this one. Our first race with our team, Seneca. And what's our objective for this race? So we need to finish 10th place or higher in this semi-pro season. All right, 22. Remember what Addo said. Just try and keep up with you, mate, and bring the car back in one piece. Okay, so they just want to uh, want us to keep up with our teammate and finish the race, really. And we need to be 10th or higher. Let's see how we get on. There's our teammate. Let's see how we get on then. Two laps around here. We're starting in 15th position. Where's our teammate? Our teammate is up in 10th by the look of it. Looks like it's going to be another quite enclosed circuit. Barriers all around street circuit, quite narrow. So it might be tricky to overtake. As always with these uh, story races, I'm not familiar with any of these tracks whatsoever, but we have got the indications on the road to show us the, uh, the racing lines in and around the corner and also what sort of speed we should be going for. Making up a few places here, up the inside, just want to take it easy not to uh, damage the car and like the team said, they just want me to finish the race really. Oh, got a bit of a slide on there. I think it's a little bit of snow on the ground by the look of it and it's a little bit icy and slippy. Got a good, lap, uh, good gap ahead of us here so we can break with comfort into this corner. Car side by side so there's very little room to pass. We'll just hold our place, see if we can get a better run somewhere. Look at the inside here, maybe. Can I hold this position? Yeah, that's another place. Up into 12th then. I think I can see our teammate a couple of places ahead of us. Just in the distance. Yeah, I think that's our teammate right ahead. So, want to be a little bit careful now. Last thing we want to do is take them out. That will not go down well with the team at all. We'll go side by side here. Hopefully they don't drift wide on this corner and leave us enough space. Pulling past, need to make sure I'm passed by the next corner. Oh, this is a long straight section. Brake hard, Ooh, just tap the back of the car in front, but nothing too bad. I'll get a run up here if I can hold the inside round here. Whoa, big wiggle as I tried to accelerate away. Yeah, track is, is definitely uh, slippy. It's it's not too bad actually cornering as long as you don't go in too quick, but the difficulty I'm finding is as I try and accelerate away from the corners, that's where uh, that's where you get a bit of wheel spin on the back end. Just probably need to be a little more gentle as I put the accelerator down to pull away out of these corners. Up into seventh place now then. Okay, this is the second lap. That it was a long lap round here. So we're doing okay at the moment in that we only need to finish 10th and we're up into 6th place now. Really enjoying these uh, story mode challenges so far. We can uh, continue to have a good race here, that would be good. In the last video, if you haven't checked it out, there was uh, an open wheel race. We managed to grab a win there and then we also did some uh, testing for the Seneca team as well. That was good fun. So if we can bring home another good result here. Right up behind this car, can we get past before the next corner? We're up alongside and on the inside. Should be able to hold it, brake hard. Get the power down but not too quickly. Up into fifth place now then. Leader is only two, two and a half seconds ahead. Whoa, just a little bit wide there, managed to keep it off the barriers and we are still ahead of that group behind that are chasing us down starting to fall ahead if anything 
Right, any chance of making up any more places before the end? Closing on this gap to this little group ahead and can I maybe sneak up the inside? Just got to watch again the wheel spin as I try and accelerate away. We're okay though. Right, is this the long straight section? I think it might be. Let me grab a place and maybe another one now before this next corner. Oh, that's going to be tight. Oh, that's going to be really tight. No, I was going to get squeezed there, so just backed out of that. Up into fourth place though. Tight left hand corner coming up. Up on the curb section there. I think that's where I tend to. Uh, spin the wheels more if you're up on the curb section we're on the outside here so not sure if we're going to be able to make this work unless we go all the way around the outside nope back into fourth again I'm going to be on the inside for this corner though so I might be able to slip past yep now we've got the position up into third place then no idea how long oh this is the line here is it yeah this is the finish so third place I will take that, that was uh, comfortably good enough for the objective that we were trying to get. There we are, third on the podium. Objective complete, the finishing 10th or higher. Yeah, that was a really good, fun race. A little bit slippy, had to be just a little bit careful, but uh, good result in the end. Okay, next story, into the fray. and an elimination race at Yokohama Docks. What's our objective in this one? Finish 10th or higher. Okay, objective race then. Uh, elimination race, sorry. And... Uh, okay, just listening to the team's orders there. going to follow this group through again of course don't know the layout of this track at all so we'll try and use the uh, indicators on the track as much as possible and also follow the lines of a lot of the cars ahead of us in we if we can up to 14th we need to finish 10th elimination race so as soon as that counter reaches zero the car who is at the back at the time is going to get eliminated so we've got a little bit of time at the moment but uh, of course we want to be as far up the field as we can we're up into 10th place now and even 9th as we take that one on the outside so if we can even stay in this position we're objective complete but let's see if we can do even better than that tight left hand corner here we can slide it all the way around the outside again another place up into 8th then now Our teammate is uh, back in 11th by the look of it Get a rim in. No, that's not going to work. I'm trying to send it up the inside there. That would uh, end quite badly, I think. Oh, this is a tricky section through here. It's quite quick, and uh, without knowing the line properly, I'm literally just having to follow the others through. We can take that one on the outside, though, up into seventh place now, then. Got a good one here. Can I hold it all the way out on the outside? Yeah, made up a few places there. We are right up behind third and we might get this one as well. Yeah, up into third. There's another car eliminated. Down to, what is that? Can't quite see, is that 14? 14 cars left? Can't quite see because it's in the red colour. It doesn't stand out that well. We are in a good position though. Right, where are the lead two? There's the back end of second place, just in sight. In fact, that is first place. There was another, has a car just gone out? Did the car crash? I didn't see what happened there. But all of a sudden, we are in second place and chasing down the leader who is right ahead of us. There's another car eliminated. Our teammate is in eight, so they're still okay, probably for few more eliminations but they're gonna have to watch 
right, can we perhaps get a win? Any way of overtaking this car? I'm all the way around the outside again. It's worked before, and I'm up alongside and through. Just gonna hold it around these tight corners here. Right, the only problem now with being in the lead is I have got no one to follow, so I'm gonna have to uh, try and remember the lines and corners to take here. Corners like this aren't too bad actually, because you can spot them on the uh, on the map, and you know that you've got a break. It's more the it's more the fast sections where you've uh, whoa just caught the inside there. Damn, gone out wide. Are we still ahead? Up alongside again. No, we've still held it. Just about nearly lost the lead there. Just got away with it. Yeah, as I was saying, the sections it, it's the fast corners where you need to to get the right lines that it's uh, that it's tricky because uh, of course there's no indications there. Whereas the tight corners like this, it's it's not too bad, you can glance at the map and also use those indication lines. Okay, this is like that little chicane section, is it? Yeah. Power through here, a couple of tight right hand corners coming up. Eight cars left in the race, and we've pulled a little gap back to second place now as well. We might be able to get a win here, that would be really good if we could. The elimination time seemed to be coming down as well. Getting through the cars really quick, down to six cars now. And there's another one gone as well. So I wonder if they got eliminated or if they maybe one crashed out or something like that. Another one's going in six seconds. Uh, in fact, it's even I think it's eliminated two at a time now. We're down to four. Two are in red, so yeah, I think it's going to be another two to go. Well, again, I've over steered there slightly, but we are in the top two now. We're in first place, so as long as we just hold it together, we are going to be good. Just 10 more seconds we need to hold this lead for. Nice long straight section here, which should be good enough to see us through to the finish. Yeah, first place. Well, that was really good fun and uh, makes for a bit of a nervous race, the elimination race. Fortunately, we were never too near the back when the timer was ticking down. So, objective complete again. So, that's another two sections of the story successfully completed. I hope you've enjoyed watching this video and see you soon.